Indian Prime Minister Narendra Modi laid the foundation stones for three semiconductor facilities in India, marking a significant step towards the country's goal of becoming a semiconductor manufacturing hub. In recent times, there has been a significant increase in the demand for semiconductors due to various factors, including the growing acceptance of 5G technology, the increasing demand for processing units due to cryptocurrency mining, and the government's ongoing efforts towards digitalization. Take a look. जो नीतियां बना रहा है उसका भी हमें स्ट्रेटेजिक एडवांटेज मिले the Prime Minister of India, Narendra Modi, on March 13th addressed India's decade, chips for Vixit Bharat program, and laid the foundation stone for three semiconductor projects worth about Rs. 1.25 lakh crores via video conferencing. The foundation stone was laid for three crucial projects the semiconductor fabrication facility at the Dholera Special Investment Region. DSIR Gujarat, outsourced semiconductor assembly and test, OSAT facilities at Morigaon in Assam and Sanand in Gujarat. While addressing the youth across the country on the occasion, PM said that made in India semiconductor chips will take the country towards self-reliance and modernity. सेमीकंडक्टर मैन्युफैक्चरिंग का एक बड़ा ग्लोबल हब बनाने में मदद करेगी मैं सभी देशवासियों को इस महत्वपूर्ण पहल के लिए ये महत्वपूर्ण शुरुआत के लिए एक मजबूत कदम के लिए इस आयोजन को लेकर के बहुत बहुत बधाई देता हूं रिकॉग्नाइजिंग द सिग्निफिकेंस ऑफ द सेमीकंडक्टर इंडस्ट्री द इंडियन गवर्नमेंट हैज इंप्लीमेंटेड वेरियस मेजर्स एंड पॉलिसीज इन दिसंबर 2021 द गवर्नमेंट कमिटेड एन इंप्रेसिव रुपी 76000 क्रोस दैट इज 10 बिलियन यूएस डॉलर्स to catalyze the semiconductor manufacturing ecosystem in India. In July last year, Semicon India Conference 2023 was organized in Gujarat's Gandhinagar, which proved to be a success as leaders of the industry hailed India's vision in this sector. The theme of the Semicon India Conference 2023 was catalyzing India's semiconductor ecosystem. PM Narendra Modi had invited global semiconductor majors to take first movers advantage and invest in India. The conclave witnessed participation of major companies such as Micron Technology, Applied Materials, Foscon, SEMI, AMD among others. It has been the Prime Minister's vision to position India as a global hub for semiconductor design manufacturing and technology development, fostering the creation of employment opportunities for the nation's youth. We have started the semiconductor mission in two years ago. We have started the initiatives. In this month, we have signed the MOUs in the first month. और आज सिर्फ कुछ महीनों के भीतर हम तीन प्रोजेक्ट्स का सिलान्यास कर रहे हैं इंडिया कमिट्स इंडिया डिलीवर्स एंड डेमोक्रेसी डिलीवर्स in recent times, there has been a significant increase in the demand for semiconductors due to various factors including the growing acceptance of 5G technology, the increasing demand for processing units due to cryptocurrency mining and the government's ongoing efforts towards digitalization. With its population of over 1.4 billion and robust education system, 
India has the potential to become a talent powerhouse in the semiconductor industry and help ease the severe shortage of skilled professionals.